Baby fish. Today, we are invited to a very important place, to the house of Alesta. Me and my friends are very excited. For the first time, we're going to join a mermaids event. I need to go before it's too late. I can't believe I almost forgot Alesta's present. I wonder what surprises are waiting for us. Hey, come on, we can go now. I still can't believe that we're going to Alesta's event. <laughs> I'll be the best dancing fish of the party. <laughs> I don't think it's an event for dancing. Alesta invited us to lunch, silly. <laughs> I'm so hungry. I hope she's prepared some very delicious things. Maybe she's going to talk about a new discovery. After all, we all know how wise the mermaids are, right? They're always reading and researching. I think Alesta will share a new discovery with us. We can learn what this event is about when we arrive there. Come on, let's go, friends. It will be a long journey. <laughs> hmm? Huh? This is a baby fish. Hey, man, there's a baby fish here. A baby fish, huh? Leave him there, Biba. Come on, I don't want to miss the event. But he's so small and his mom's not around. I can't believe this. Why can't we just go to an event without any trouble? Baby fish are always hungry and they always cry. Mm -hmm. Also, they're gassy. I mm -hmm. think we should leave them here and run away. Mm -hmm. I agree with Babu. Let's get going. Uh, come on now, friends. Look how adorable he is. Don't forget that we were also babies once. We need to help him out. <laughs> You see that? Look, he's crying. Come on, Biba! Don't cry, little baby fish. I don't see anybody around. We can't leave this cute fish here. He is now under our responsibility. Got it? We must do our best. All right, then. Let him come with us. Goochie, goochie, goo! Goochie, goochie, goo! <laughs> Look, he's smiling. He's not that bad. I think he might be a good road fellow. Alesta said that only young fish can come to her event. I don't think she would want a baby fish to be there. We can put him in our bag. He can wait silently in there. <laughs> I hope that it'll happen as you say, Tootie, because this voice can be heard even by the seagulls of Bosphorus. I think we should find this baby's mother. We can find his mother and then still make it to the event. I wonder what kind of fish he is. But what if it's a baby shark, Chupa? <laughs> what if he suddenly grows and bites us all? <laughs> I don't think so. He doesn't look to me like a baby shark. Let's ask every fish we come across. Mm -hmm. That's a wonderful <laughs> idea, Biba. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's keep moving. Where am I? <laughs> Bigaboo. Hey there, Red. Is there anyone who knows this baby? Huh? Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Hey. hey, guys. Oh. He, he might be my kid, you know. I think he looks like me. Oh, how cute. Sorry, Big Nose. This baby is too small to be your kid. Your kid has to be bigger. Fish, this baby cannot be mine. I think this baby has no parents. This is Bosphory. We Bosphory fish never, under any circumstances, leave our babies alone. I think he has a problem. Oh my, something's happening to me. <laughs> The smell is coming from him? What are we going to do now, guys? 
The one who picks the shortest straw changes the diaper. Oh, goodness. This is the worst thing to ever happen to me. Ooh, a very strange smell indeed. What are you eating? Oh, that's it now. I got it. <laughs> Any ideas? He's sleeping. Now he's so quiet. I think he can come with us no problem. Let's get going. <laughs> to Alesta's home. I'm so excited. I hope that baby fish doesn't wake up. I was waiting for all of you. Welcome, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Let the dance begin. <laughs> What's wrong? So many books. I want to read them all at the same time. <laughs> oh, good. Let the book activity begin then. <laughs> Did, Did you, you say, say book, book activity? activity? If you don't mind, I want to read the first book. Huh? Well, we didn't want to come here empty-handed, so we brought you this. <laughs> A music CD. <gasps> huh? We thought that we could, you know, listen to some music and dance. <laughs> Well, thank you. You're so kind. Uh oh. Not me. Huh? Is everything okay? Yeah, sure thing. Let's continue. <laughs> now, where were we? Little needlefish wants so much attention. Mm -hmm. This is a story of a needlefish. From a family of Scomborosity, he lives in a warm, hot sea. A cylinder-shaped body with a long and sharp mouth, mm -hmm. strong teeth. Its back and two sides are colored green and dark blue. Oh. <coughs> are you a needlefish? <laughs> hmm? Say, I was wondering what these needlefish look like. Let's see, everyone. According to this book, as big as a quarter of a goldfish. This is a baby needlefish. <laughs> Where did you find him? Huh? Say, have you seen that latest movie? They said that it's the must-see movie of the year. Hmm, I have not. Now, if everyone will pay attention, I can begin this fantastic tale. Oh. This is going to be the best! <laughs> <laughs> what is going on, you guys? Are you guys keeping a secret? Huh? We found him alone. He must have lost his mother. Why didn't you tell me this in the first place? <laughs> he, he's a bit noisy. We thought that you wouldn't like him. His kind shouldn't stay too long in this water. We should take him to his family as soon as possible. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now he's with his family. Mm -hmm. That's right, Chupa. You finally got rid of him. You can throw a celebration now. It smells really bad when you poop, but I'm going to miss you. <laughs> Don't forget me, okay? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> no! Uh, He's my dear little brother! Uh, I got used to him! <laughs> uh, <laughs> come on, Chupa! Don't do that! It's hard for us 
to leave him as well. When you grow up, come and visit us. I'll miss you so much. <laughs> I feel so terrible. I loved him so much. No, oh, I miss him already. Hmm. Oh, it's so sad. I can't bear it. But I know it's going to make you feel a lot better. Hmm? So what's that? Reading a book, of course. You're right, Alesta. A book is the perfect thing I need right now. This sadness can only be healed by the stories. Mm -hmm. 